Hey everyone, Jessica here. And as a lot of you guys know, it's the 36 days of type Instagram prompt going on. And for that, I thought I would do something a little different, a little fun. And I thought I would incorporate Photoshop brushes because if you follow me, you know how crazy I am about Photoshop brushes and all the cool things you can do with that. So I kind of want to highlight this and do a fun giveaway. And so we'll have a little fun with it. So, um, you can, I'll have the link down below so you can download this brush on my website, no registration or anything required. And also I've recently done, um, a couple collaborations with Adobe, um, with Photoshop brush work. And I made some really cool free brushes that are available on Adobe website. So I'll put those links down below. So this brush is actually um, a slightly modified version of one of my iridescent brushes from my iridescent collection and I have a huge collection of iridescents and I absolutely just love this effect. So um, in your download folder you're going to have an ABR brush and it's already all set up and ready to paint which means it's using the tool preset setting and I've already got the pattern, um, the tool preset, sorry, the pattern stamp tool setting and I've got the um, pattern already in there for you so it's totally ready to go. Now if you're using an older version of Photoshop like CS6 Plus you can load the tool preset and so you'll be able to use it no matter what version and if you're not familiar with loading brushes make sure you display your brush panel and um, if you don't see that you can go to window brushes and pop that out and to load up your brush, you just go to the top right corner and click Import Brushes. And you can just find your file and load that up there. If you're on an older version, you can load it as a tool preset. Go make sure your tool preset window is showing. Go to Window, Tool Presets. And same thing, top right, Load Tool Presets. So either way, you're going to have the brush. And I have it here. And um, if you're not familiar, this is using my color blending technique that I've kind of pioneered and made really popular using the pattern stamp tool. So rather than just using the regular brush tool, you go to your pattern stamp tool over here on your left and you select your brush. In this case, we already have it selected. And then you load up a pattern file and in this case, I already have it here for you, um, which is a blend of colors. And so that whenever I paint with that brush, all these colors that are in my pattern file are going to come spitting out of the brush. And if you use a normal brush, it's going to look terrible. But if you specially design it, you can make some really cool brushes. And if you'll notice, my aligned is turned off, but my impressionist is turned on. But like I said, if you load up these brushes, um, that's already going to be done for you. So literally all you have to do is paint. And so what I did was um, in my Instagram video when I demoed this, I just used the A, the shape of the A as a clipping mask. So I've got my brush layer here. And so I'm just going to select all and I'll cut that to delete it. And so I've got my letter A, I've got my clipping mask and my brush layer. And I'm just going to go here to my iridescent brush. And like I said, you don't have to do anything. Now, if I'm going like this, you see the colors that are all blending and changing, which is really cool. I have a light pressure right now. So if you have a light pressure, you're going to just see the pattern coming out. But if I push a little more pressure down, look what happens with this. It's so cool. And you can just have like, you can push this down and see more of the brush shape, go a little bit lighter and you see that pattern again. So it's totally dynamic and really fun. And see, I'm going light again. Let's just map out that shape here. And then maybe I want a little softer transition. So I'm just going to kind of go like that. And then look at that. This is totally cool. I love the iridescence. I love, um, like watching the colors changing around. And what's crazy is this is like not even, um, there's no layer styles. This is 100% Photoshop brush magic. So it's actually <laughs> still going there. 
Um, 100% Photoshop magic, and you, I've specially designed these brushes um, that's taken ages of work, but super cool, really fun, iridescent kind of effects. And what's it's really fun to brush them because then you see it change and it's live and it's really dynamic. So hopefully you guys will enjoy this brush. If you make something, be sure to tag me at Creators Couture on Instagram. And if you like this, be sure to sign up for my newsletter because I usually I get a newsletter out weekly and um, I always have good stuff for my newsletter people. So I've got exclusive tutorials. I try to throw a freebie in every week, all kinds of good stuff. So sign up for my newsletter and definitely check out the iridescent collection because if you like this, I have a whole collection of brushes and I'm going to have them on special for a limited time so you can check them out. And if you have any questions, just let me know down below in the comments and just have fun with this brush and then come back soon because I've got some more 36 days of Thai brush freebies on the way. So I'm really excited to share those with you.